Bannister leading them forward with Yggdrasil. Starter lets them go. They're running for the Grade 1 Coral Finale Juvenile Hurdle. Bannister will lead Yggdrasil down to the first of eight flights with... Ugri racing in third on the outside of Nassalam. Bannister four lengths clear, jumping the first, which they all took safely. Pyramid Place is dropped right out, last of all, as Bannister begins to establish a long lead running down the hill. Yggdrasil is leading the chasing group, but he's already 12 lengths behind Bannister with Ugri and Nassalam racing in a share of third as they go into the turn. Then Mr. Shady on the outside of Adagio. Elam Valley held up on the inside. And finally, Pyramid Place, as Bannister makes his way up the hill into the back straight. More than a dozen lengths clear of his nearest rival, who remains Yggdrasil. So Bannister has leveled off to race down the back, where four flights of hurdles are situated. The first three of them coming up quite quickly. Bannister by a good dozen lengths from Yggdrasil, who's now got Nassalam for company. On their outside is Ugri, as Bannister comes across flight number two, doesn't jump it at all fluently, but remains well clear. Nassalam jumped into second at the first in the back straight. Bannister safely over the third, with a 15 length advantage over Nassalam, who's followed over by Yggdrasil, Adagio, Ugri and Elam Valley as Bannister jumps the third flight of hurdles in the back straight. A dozen lengths clear of Nassalam, Ugri and Yggdrasil. After those is Elam Valley, then Adagio, who's followed by Mr. Shady, and Pyramid Place remains last of all. Bannister clips the top of the final flight in the back straight, his advantage down to about eight lengths now, with Nassalam second and closing in. Ugri races third in front of Elam Valley and Yggdrasil and Adagio. And then three lengths back to Mr. Shady. And Pyramid Place has raced in detached last since the starter let them go and remains there. They're on the long gallop between flights five and six. Bannister's advantage down to four lengths as Ugri has moved into second place on the outside of Nassalam. Adagio is fourth as they begin the turn. Then follows Elam Valley with Yggdrasil being ridden along to hold his position. Last of the leading group of six who are now well grouped. Three lengths back to Mr. Shady and a further five lengths to Pyramid Place who has still yet to pass a rival. They're on the approach to the home straight in the Coral Finale Juvenile Hurdle with three to jump. Bannister's stay out in front is about to come to an end as Nassalam and Ugri move up either side and breeze past him. Elam Valley and Adagio have moved into third and fourth, jumping three out, then Bannister, followed by Mr. Shady. Pyramid Place has relegated Yggdrasil to be the back marker. Three of them have gone clear now as Elam Valley appears to have been seen off as they jump two from home. Nassalam away to the left. Ugri made a mistake when holding every chance. Adagio is now coming after Nassalam as they race down towards the final quarter of a mile with one more flight of hurdles to jump. Nassalam has Adagio to worry about and they've gone sixth clear of Ugri in third. Elam Valley at the one pace is back in fourth. Adagio has been ridden to the front on their way down to the final flight by Tom Scudamore. Adagio from Nassalam. Now two lengths between them. A long gap to Ugri in third. Adagio winged the final flight landed three lengths clear Nassalam looks held in second a long gap to Ugri in third it's the Daggio for David Pipe and Tom Scudamore who win the finale juvenile hurdle putting Nassalam firmly in his place back in third was Ugri Elam Valley and the staying on Yggdrasil were fourth and fifth